problems with remembering things. Oh yeah, Findig, I've met him plenty of times. Oh. Yeah, me and Findig did some business a while back. I ended up getting paid twice as much as I asked for it, and tried to return half the money, but he wouldn't take it, because he thought I was giving him charity. <laughs> I had a... well, let's just leave it at I had a very long argument with him about it, and eventually just left the money on the ground, and hoped he wouldn't remember I left it there. Well, I guess he forgot, has forgotten, so we're probably new customers. Let's yeah. go in. Uh, hello? You go in, and there's no one in the front, just a uh, a dwarf, <coughs> like, just standing there, actually. You see, you see that he's standing on a, like, uh, he's standing, he's at, on the counter, and you see that he's, like, on a ladder. Small ladder. I, I, like, I, like, place my weapon on the ground, and, like, the ace, try to lift it one more time. Come on, man. Just try to lift it, dude. I mean, it weighs a ton, so I can't lift it. I mean, it doesn't actually weigh a ton. It weighs like half a ton. Yeah. I'm just saying, I can't lift it. I tried Come on, before. Try it. try it, dude. Come on. Uh, I guess, uh, as I can recall, uh, weight doesn't disappear by walking somewhere. By, by walking? What do you mean? I can try lifting it again for you. Yeah, come on, dude. Come on, you can do it this time, I believe in you. Come on. <laughs> come on, put your back into it. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking breaks his back. <laughs> Spine just, he like, just become, it, it, becomes paralyzed. I like, I, like, I like pat Ace on the back and I'm like, it's alright, dude. You'll be able to lift it one day. I'm Tom! Can I try? <laughs> yeah, sure. Come on, dude. I will. You, uh, you can do it, Blizzar. I will look at it and get tired. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just the and, thought of uh, seeing it exhausts you. <laughs> you see the dwarf yeah. like slowly walking down, going into the back room, and as he opens the door, a, a blinding, flashing light blinds him. Like, ah, uh, uh, what the uh, fuck is that, dude? <laughs> Findig. <laughs> Customers. And, 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 Hi there, old man. Fuck off. And then it goes in the back. So, the way to treat your customers? I didn't even I want this job. I lift my weapons from the ground again. Yeah. Uh, Findy comes out and he's like, Ooh, new customers! Mm. Well, hello, Findy. It's uh, Aegis. You probably met me before, but you don't remember. No. No. I've never met him before, Finnig. No. Well, hey, Finnig, Finnig. Finnig. Okay, one at a time, one at a time. Oh, what? Me? What, green boy? Green boy. Do you remember me? No. I thought so. Oh, well, my good friend, we are here for... You to identify our magical items. How many? Uh, um, well, well, I have, well, I have one. Okay. Well, I have... Um, I can do five at a time. Five at a time. Okay. One, two, three. I, I, I turn to Ace and I say, Well, I think we should all do one. And then the two of you should do one extra, since I only have one that I don't know what is. Fine, fine. Yeah, because I think, I think, um, I, I, I'm still talking to Ace. I think you picked up uh, two, didn't you? And Blizzard picked up two items from the backpack of the, the ogre. Well, not as I recall, but yeah, sure. I well, I remember I picked up two, but... Uh... Yeah, I picked up this cloak and this gauntlet, so... Yeah. Okay. And you, Blizzar? I uh, got a shield. <clears throat> oh yeah, right, yeah, yeah. Um, so, so we have four in total, is that right? 
Yeah, mm. from from the from the ogre you got three items. Yeah. And everybody has a random magic item that they got some 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 time in <laughs> ever, <laughs> I guess. I don't know. All right. I, I I know some of you has has some magic items that uh, you don't know what is. Mm. I, I, Never mind. I he, he dropped four items: the robe, and gauntlet, sword, and shield. Yeah. Mm. So I, I I place my sword at the counter, and I say, "This is the first one." Okay, I'm I'm gonna need all of them. Okay. Yep. Um. Come on, guys. First the gauntlet. I I, I I do five at the same time. Okay. I I bring out the cloak and the gauntlet. Uh, and, uh, but the price is gonna be a hundred gold, because I need to use a pearl. Yeah, sure. Uh, uh, no worries. <laughs> uh, Who pays? Uh, we all pay, right? <laughs> yeah, we do pay all. <laughs> I if, can if, pay. Well, well it, it, if both of you do 50 gold, and I do a hundred gold, that's a hundred, right? No. What? If we do, if we split it on three, it's thirty three point three 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 three. Yeah. But that would add up to three hundred and thirty three gold. No. Because you need three hundred and thirty three gold. You need two zeros, but we, we well, don't well, have two zeros. Well, guys, I I I I know how to do it. We all put in 75 gold. No. And that's 100. No. That's not 100 gold. He's not very good on numbers, I think. No? Okay. I take care of the numbers. No okay, well, if I put in 80, and you put in 70, and he puts in 60, that's 100, right? No. I guess I'll teach your math. I'll teach your basic math at some point. <laughs> Well, well, do you have the money? Uh, yes, we do. Well, pay Ace, how much? How much is it for each? It's thirty-three gold pieces. I pay. It is. Yeah, he's back. Oh, he's gone again. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I can. It's you need to pay. Let's all do thirty-four. Thirty-four gold pieces. All right. I put down. I put down thirty-six gold pieces. Okay. Close enough. Thirty-three. Yeah. Um. Here's two gold back. Um. For for me. Yeah. But I gave you thirty-four. No, you gave me thirty. Okay. I I guess I'll take him. Okay. Thanks. I guess. Uh. Okay. I'll be back in. Give me like. One minute. And she's like, <sighs> he tries to lift the sword and it's like, hey. Should I, should I carry that for you? No, no, no. I got, I got it. I got it. He eats some spinach and lifts the sword. He begins casting some spell, and uh, the sword, like the old items, begin to float. Mm. And, and, it fo and it follows him. And you go in the back room, close the door. You see a shining light on the like uh, edges. You know, you know the, um, the you know the 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 hole the hole in between the door and the frame. Uh, and uh, then it, then he comes out, and you're like, hmm. okay, I'm done. Who wants to know what? Do do the shield first. I'm curious. Okay. 
do you want your information sh revealed to everyone or yes okay this shield is something I've never seen before. It's uh, it's called uh, a uh, bleeding heart shield. And that? well, it's a shield. It's a magical shield. Uh, it's yeah. A, it enhances your defensive capabilities first of all because it's magical, of course. Da. Cool. Um, but you can also uh, sacrifice some of your own defense to boost an ally's defense. Hmm. Hmm. But but don't do it too many times, or there will be some uh, a a toll a toll of some sort on your body. I don't know what, but I don't want to find out. Okay, what's next? Ace? Yes, I can. The gauntlets, um, they float. Uh, this right here is a, um, this right here is something called, something also I've never, like, really seen before. It's called the Dragon Emperor's Gauntlet. Uh, it lets you, it makes you, uh, one with a dragon. So you kind of become one, kind of. What do you mean by become one? How, how well, does... you technically identify as a dragon. How? Well, oh. your, your appearance might be changed. You might have scales, you might have tail, you might have eyes change. I don't know what that happened to you, but um, you can also store free weapons in the glowing, glowing orb. Yeah. And uh, it has some command words, so you need to. Uh, he he tells you this in draconic, actually. He's like, well, you need to say weapon storage to to be able to access the orb and then you have to say the weapon you have in it weapon storage and weapon inside uh, you have uh, you have um, you have something called if I got the translation right you have something called uh, uh, dragon emperor's boost of some sort Okay. Uh, it lets you harness a bit of its power, but uh, after a minute, this this power that you earn get, takes a toll on you. Okay. I don't know what uh, the toll is, but it didn't specify. And okay. you have something called a red dragon armor, which encases you in armor for about a minute. Um, okay. This is a one-time use, by the way. H how long? Uh, a minute. Oh. A minute. Each uh, day. Uh, uh, you can use it at it. It it, it gains the ability back at e uh, each dawn. Okay. And you have something called um. Um. Mighty penetration. Mighty penetration. At a, cer <laughs> at, at, at a certain toll, it lets you penetrate even the greatest defenses. Huh. What do you a, say? A, 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 it's it's a quite it's a quite um it's a quite um dangerous item, I would say. But you do you. I, I, by the way, I, I will, I will, uh, in, in the, in the handout I give you, I am gonna write the abilities of the item in the description notes. Okay. Okay, so, huh, is that all? That's all. You said you can 
You so if we're going to access weapons, it's weapon storage. Weapons. Well, you have to know the draconic, of course. Well, yeah, I kind of do now. But I think the gauntlet already gives you that. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I didn't try it on. I wouldn't. I didn't want it there. Um, Could I store? So I ha do you know how big of a storage I have? Well, three weapons. Three weapons. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> Catapult. Oh <laughs> uh, yes. I don't know what how how uh, I don't know if, if, I don't know if it means. Um, I, I mean, I don't know if it, if it, if it only counts for weapons or siege weapons. I don't know. You you find out yourself. Okay. Uh, what about the cloak? Uh, it's not a cloak. It's actually a robe. A robe, yes, the robe. Um, and this is something called the monk's robe. A monk's robe. Uh, when worn by someone who's uh, who is a monk, um, she is uh, empowered as she's as uh, it acts as like it's stronger. Like you're gain some experience. Per se. What if you're not a monk? Well, then unfortunately, well, I, it won't be doing much. <laughs> but if you have someone in your monk, in a monk, uh, someone that uses unarmed combat or f the flurry ability, whatever it's called, I don't care. Um, you, could, you should give it to them, I guess. Or you can sell it to me. What would you do with it? I don't know. Throw it in the back. Okay. Bizarre, do you want it? Yeah, yeah. sure. Okay, I throw it to Blizzard. Hey, me, Dad. Huh? Now I understand why he was so sad Thorgrim died. Uh-huh? <laughs> no, it wasn't a cloak. It was a shield. Okay, so the cloak was random. <laughs> I guess the next is the sword. Yeah, do the sword. Ah, <sighs> the big sword. Well, I can already tell you that it's not. It's 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 a great sword, but it's not a normal great sword. Yeah. Well, uh, it's something uh, called the Berserker's Blade. Um. It has bonus. It's it's if you're fighting anything that's aberration, celestial, fiend, devil, demon, or undead, uh, you ignore their immunities and damage reduction, I think, and you deal some extra physical damage as this is made to slay them, and uh, you can also. It has some uh, enchantment to it that lets it uh, change its own gravity, which means you can use the, you can wield it pretty well, but you can, but you can also let the weight of it, um, uh, weight of it, kind of smash down on it. You know, you're sacrificing speed, but you gain power. You know. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I, if I would give this uh, a name, I would call it the Heavy Swing. I know, totally original. <laughs> and uh, it also has a property of something called Cleave, if you're familiar with that. Yeah. I think I've, um... I think I've heard one of my, uh... One of my master's friends talk about cleaving orcs, but, uh... It's... Cleaving is... The, 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 it's I would call this it, cleaving strikes. So this sword has a specific enchantment which lets it transfer. If if you kill something, the remaining of the damage you on the creature ch could can transfer to an adjacent creature, giving him the damage. And if that if, right. and if that if that damage kills the next creature, it just continues until you don't have any more damage. Or if, uh, but it comes with a, uh, it comes with a, uh, a very inaccurate. Yeah. So 
this sword is very only for the righteous, I would say. And it's kind of bloodthirsty. It's not it's not intelligent, but it's bloodthirsty. All right. It doesn't like. I mean, it, it, it was a sword made for slaying abominations. Yep. Um. And it's it also has a third degree enchantment. A third degree? Third degree. What what does, what does that mean? Uh, take a uh, take a arcana or spellcraft. Well, I'm not trying to tell him what it means. I'm trying to ask him what it means. Oh yeah. Um. I mean, I'll still take a spellcraft to see if I understand it. Want me to do that? Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Holy shit, dude. You guys are genius now. Oh. Um, you know that when it says degree of magic, it's the plus of the sword. So this is a plus three sword with some additional abilities. Alright, alright, okay, okay, okay. Well, it's a, pl it's a third degree sword, but it's also a fifth degree because of the, all the abilities and stuff. Okay, okay. But for practical purposes, it's a third degree. Yes. Okay, yeah. Thank you, Fendig. Well, As was... I, I, well, I lift the sword up and put it on my shoulder. Was there any more items? No, that was it. Uh, well, well, I do have some items on me, which I want to okay. find out. You can throw them on. Okay, a bandana, my belt, ring, my nagata, my... Kuya! Oh fuck, it. where's my notes? There they are! Um... Okay. Um... Okay, uh, that would be another another hundred gold. Now, I guess I'll be poor again. There we go, a hundred gold. Okay, give me one minute as he like just whoosh, scoops him up and goes in the back room. Goes a minute, comes out again. He's like, okay, what do you want to know about first? I want to know about the belt, which I already know, but I don't need to know about it. Well, the belt is uh, a belt that increases your dexterity. Oh. Uh, the bandana. Yes. Is a something that increases charisma. Charisma? Yes. Huh. Wait, is that is that wrong? Yeah, you oh. last time you said I were well I picked it up you said I were smarter. Whose headband was this? Huh? Was it was it Ilion or Twalili's headband? Al uh, Ilion's. Did Twalili have a headband? Maybe. Um it didn't say in their notes. Well, um, um. yes, this is a um, this is a uh, something called a headband of vast intelligence. It gives oh. you a bonus on intelligence. It makes you smarter. Like me. Okay. Uh, what next? The weapon. Okay. Ah, this eastern weapon is something quite special. It, um, it's a, uh, it's a second degree item. Yeah. And it has a special ability to transform into any weapon. Not any weapon, but, uh, any weapons of its eastern predecessory. Um, so, I can choose what weapon, but I don't know how to fight with these weapons. Yes. And I would just, and um, how it works is that you need to think of an eastern weapon and kind of think that this, this weapon, when you hold it, you gotta think of the weapon and then it transforms. Mm -hmm. So any eastern weapon, for all. Okay. 
And, uh, as you see, your hands are also a bit blackish. Yeah, I noticed. They, um, they actually give you some uh, uh, bonuses in defense. Oh. So, uh, if if any, not not physical, but not 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 like a sword defense, but if if ever if anyone was ever to shoot you, um, yeah. you most likely would uh, uh, they, they would most likely just hit that and miss. So do I get the defect bonus? Indeed. Okay. Of two. Oh, nice. And then there was the ring. Yeah, the ring. Yeah, this is a first grade ring of protection. Yeah. It just boosts your AC. Huh. So the weapon you have is a transforming plus two Naginata. Yeah. A headband of vast intelligence. Belt of incredible dexterity. And... Um, ring of protection plus one. Uh, where do I put it on? Should I just put it on natural? Uh, the yeah. ring? No, uh, never mind. Yeah, I got it. There we go. Uh, because, um, that, you gotta remember that a deflection AC adds to your total AC. Yeah. But this AC only counts against ranged. Yeah. So, you still have so, a normal uh, AC, you just have to say, ah, I have that much against ranged. Yeah. And, uh, this, the, but the ring of protection is a deflection bonus to everything. Okay. Well, so I have 19 in AC total. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Uh, was that all? Good. Yes, that was all. Oh, yeah. Um, uh, Jack, uh, I have now added the notes to to the sword yep. handouts. Um, and yeah, what do you do now? I guess we... Shall we just have a drink? I'm down for a drink. Yeah, I'll drink. I feel a uh, dragon punch, actually. That isn't you, though. Well, I guess. Well, thank you, my good friend, and we'll be off now, Pendig. Goodbye. 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 Have Hold a great on. day, and um, careful with that sword. Don't uh, don't ruin my floor. I won't, Pendig. I uh, just keep leaning it on my shoulder, and I leave the shop. And then he's, and then he like. Oh, Hank! You gotta go, you, no, you, you gotta go back to your stand. And uh, yeah, you leave and you go to the tavern. Yeah. Um. Bonnie.